When working around the door window motor, make sure it cannot be operated while working. Place the remote key far enough away from the car so that the car cannot be powered. You will need to remove the rear door panel to access the motor. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with that task. With the panel off, the window motor is located on the door. Use a pick and pull out the red locking tab on the electrical connection, blue arrow. Squeeze in on the tab, blue arrow, and separate the electrical connection. Use a T20 torque and remove the three screws holding the motor to the regulator, red arrows. Pull the motor off of the three plastic pegs that connect it to the regulator, red arrows. The geared teeth on the motor must line up with the geared teeth on the regulator when reinstalling, blue arrow. This image shows the geared teeth that must sit flush within the regulator. You may have to move the window up and down a little bit to get the motor to fit correctly. Installation is the reverse of removal. Torque the hardware to 3.3 newton meters or 2 foot pounds. To teach the end positions of the windows, reinstall the door panel and start the vehicle. Pull the rocker switch until the window is fully closed. Pull the switch again and the upper position is stored. Press the rocker switch down until the window is fully open, then press the switch down again. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.